Hi folks, hope you're doing well today. Why would people from the former USSR republics have nostalgia for Soviet times? Well, several reasons. There wasn't any selfish profiteering back then, which back in the 90s, during the transitory period, there was, and there's still some of that even now. Plus, the party dictatorship kept the oligarchs in line, and then there's also the poverty gap, too, that you have to consider. In capitalism, the rich are rich at the expense of the poor, but in communism, everyone's equally poor, save for a tiny minority. There is this Persian reporter, Behzad Blur, who made this documentary with BBC Persian in Tajikistan a while back, where he interviewed the locals and asked them about the communist era and what it was like, and they said that their USSR era was superior to their current one by miles, that it was almost a paradise here back then, that people didn't have to worry about tomorrow because the government looked after them and actually gave a shit about them and so on. Certain aspects of Soviet rule were indeed loathsome and evil, like them not being able to celebrate Nowruz in public, but the Soviet people, in retrospect, definitely took the pros of their system for granted. More movies were made, for example, more movies were made about Iranic history and mythology in the Soviet republics than they were in Iran under the Pahlavis or in Afghanistan under the Durranis. The Soviets also succeeded in everything that the Durrani rulers and even the Pahlavis failed at, such as widespread literacy and education and modernization at a pace and in a context that the locals could either get behind or that couldn't be challenged from below because of the authoritarian monolith of the Union being what it was. Afghanistan stopped being a functioning country as soon as Soviet subsidies got discontinued. Furthermore, the Middle East was more geopolitically stable during the era of Cold War bipolarity. And this is where I end my dissertation. Thank you for watching.